Version 6.6 .6 of IBM SEV1 Network Performance Monitoring introduces support for integrating FortiGate devices. Leveraging the power and scalability of SEV1's clustered architecture, data collection on small and large Fortinet deployments is incredibly easy and powerful, giving administrators real-time, deep insights into their network through various out-of-the-box reports and alerting capabilities. In this video, We'll walk through the device onboarding process and see how easy it is to start collecting and monitoring a Fortinet network by providing only a handful of parameters. We'll start by logging into the NMS web interface. Once in, we'll land on the device manager page. We'll start with a fresh installation with no devices. All we need to do is tell the NMS about FortiManager and a few SNMP parameters for devices associated with this FortiManager. To do this, we'll add a device. Let's first give a device name for the FortiManager and its IP address. Then from the drop-down menu, we'll select SD-WAN and enable FortiManager capability. Now we can provide the FortiManager API URL and credentials. NMS will use these parameters to query the API for FortiGate devices during the onboarding process and for further data enrichment. Since we're utilizing the FortiManager API to onboard its devices, we need to select Auto Discover and Monitor Associated FortiGates. Lastly, we need to include SNMP specific parameters so NMS can access FortiGates during the polling process. To do this, select SNMP from that same drop down menu. Keep in mind these SNMP parameters are for the FortiGate devices associated with FortiManager. Now we click Save as New. At this point, everything is fully automated. This new device will be placed in Discovery Queue, and once Discovery kicks off, NMS will connect to FortiManager, query its devices, onboard them, and start collecting and enriching data. The initial onboarding process is complete. From this point on, NMS will periodically query FortiManager for any new devices and onboard them as needed. After a few device polling cycles, we can jump over to Data Insight. Data Insight 6.6 .6 includes a full suite of out-of-the-box reports specifically designed and built for Fortinet. Let's take a look at the Fortinet dashboard. This dashboard is a great starting point for any sort of drill down of devices, their objects, and key metrics, including device health, interface stats, tunnels and performance SLAs, flow, IPS, and more. To drill deeper into a device, we can view device summary for one of these devices. From here, we have access to all objects associated with this device. Other key metrics are displayed here, such as reachability, latency, alerts, and topology. The FortiGate Device Summary set of reports offer even more useful tools for monitoring devices, highlighting specific device information, resource utilization, jitter, complete with intuitive graphs and gauges. Under Network and Interfaces, you get a highly detailed view of each interface on the device, with critical metrics, topology, and which interfaces get the most utilization. Performance SLA tests can be viewed here, where you can dive deeper into specific SLAs for even more detail. Similar to the other device summary page, we also have insight into various IP fix and flow metrics, IPS ADS metrics, and FortiGate's advanced session stats.